much. Well, there's a push tonight to get what some say are toxic toys out of toy stores. Demonstrators took their fight to Times Square today where they caused quite a scene. Where's the concern for public health, Toys R Us? That is the question that some health and environmental groups and concerned parents were asking this afternoon during a rally outside of the Times Square Toys R Us. What do we want? When do we want them? Now! They claim that Toys R Us won't phase out toys like their Toy Story 3 dolls, which contain PVC. The groups say that that is one of the most toxic plastics for both human health and the environment. I don't know when I walk to a shelf whether the toy that's going to delight and educate and entertain her is also going to potentially harm her health. Mike Shade from the Center for Health, Environment and Justice based here in New York City says that Toys R Us should create a system to help parents shopping for toys. One thing we want them to do is to label all the toys so that parents can find safer products for their kids. The parents we spoke to had mixed reactions about the claims. Well, we'll if I had like three year old or um, youngest kid, but by the age that they have, they don't put that in the mouth or anything. If it's harmful for our kids, they just shouldn't sell it. Like I said, they need to recall them or at least put up signs so I know what I'm getting into. Today's protesters plan to release their own report informing parents of hazardous toys, which will be released in time for the holiday shopping season. Fox 5 reached out to Toys R Us for comment. They gave us this statement. The safety of the products that we sell is our highest priority. All toys carried in our stores have been rigorously tested to meet or exceed the nation's tough new safety standards. Toys R Us has been and continues to be a leader in advocating for...